Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Scarlet and Heels. I thought it would be quite fun for me to do a what's in my bag video. And this has been my everyday bag for the last couple of weeks. If you're not familiar, this is the Chanel reissue bag. And the size that I have here is the size 226. So it's slightly larger than the Chanel Classic Medium, but it's smaller than the jumbo size. I love this size because it makes for a very good everyday bag. It's so convenient and it's very easy to wear. I usually wear it double strapped on my shoulder and it fits quite a lot so you can see these are all the things that I carry inside I don't really have to play Tetris because it's quite roomy I just dump all my things inside and I find that it's quite easy for me to find the items that I want the combination that I have this bag in is the aged calfskin with the ruthenium hardware this is my favorite combination for the reissue bag so it features this rectangular turn knock and it has all the features of a Chanel Classic set. But without further ado, let's have a look inside. The very first item is my iPhone and this is just a really fun iPhone cover that I have. It says Pringles, Sour Cream and Onion. It's really really spongy and what I really like about it is that I'm able to put my excess cards inside so that I don't lose them and sometimes when I don't want to carry a wallet, I put my credit cards in here as well. I've been using this for a couple of months so you can see that the edges are quite scratched. Green is my favourite colour and when I put this in a large tote bag, it also makes it very easy for me to find my phone. And because the texture is so squishy, sometimes I don't even have to look into my bag. I can just reach my hand into my bag and I immediately can pull this phone out. So yes, this is the first item that I have in my bag. Next item, we have my AirPod Pros. I know I have a lot of food related items. I used to love to eat Reese's. I love peanut butter. Um, this is a really cute one. I like that it's in bright orange and it also comes with a hook so I can hook it on some of my other bags with an inner pocket so I, I don't lose it easily. The only downside of this is that it can be quite bulky so if you're carrying a much smaller bag like the Chanel Mini or for me the Chanel Diner, um, it takes up quite a lot of space. But most of the time, I'm either carrying this bag or my tote bags, so I have no problems with this. It says Reese's Miniature Cups. That's how it looks like. It's really, really cute. I love it and it really makes my day looking at something so bright and colourful. And the next item is my Goyard wallet. This is the zip around wallet. It's very compact. I talked about it in a video that I uploaded last year. I got this about one year ago and I've been using it for a full year. I love that it's so compact, it fits a lot. So I stuff all my cards and some cash inside and sometimes I even have a few coins. Um, it's really compact and it fits all my mini bag. So this wallet that I have, I have it in burgundy. I think it's a really lovely color. And I really love this material. It's so scratch resistant. I don't baby it at all. And I carry this almost everywhere that I go. The next item in my bag is this pair of glasses. My degree is quite low, sometimes I do wear my contact lenses, but if not, I will carry my glasses around with me just in case I need to look at things more clearly. This is from the brand Ace and Tate. It's a brand from Amsterdam, but I bought this in London. I really love it because it's so lightweight. When you wear it, you really don't feel like you have anything on at all. I fell in love with the design. I really like the black and white trimmings. It makes it look really fun. Um, so yeah, this is what I carry along. I put it in this pouch which was given when I purchased the glasses. Sometimes I even use this Ace and Tate pouch to put my sunglasses in them. The next item is the Round Lab sunscreen. I love this sunscreen. I, I talked about this in my Korean drugstore video and this is my favourite sunscreen right now. And I love that. It doesn't even feel like sunscreen. It honestly just feels like moisturiser because it's not sticky. It doesn't leave a white cast. I bring this along when I'm not wearing makeup because the sun is so hot and I just reapply this on my face if I'm running errands or if I'm outdoors for a long period of time. I'm almost done with this tube. I've used it so much, but I'm glad that I managed to stock up a few tubes of this. And then we have the Innisfree lipstick. This is a balm and I love that the colour is so natural. 
and it's very hydrating and it's a little bit minty so I use this on days where I just need to hydrate my lips and I do not want anything too bold even when I'm wearing lipstick when I'm going out I tend to layer this as a base layer first because it moisturizes my lips before I put on the lipstick with a border color so this one is from Innisfree I talked about this in my Innisfree video and I highly recommend this then the next item that I have is a Muji pen. I have so many of these in different colors. These Muji pens are 0.5 mm and they work so well. So I always carry a pen with me just in case I need to write something down or need to fill up forms. I have a pen in almost every bag that I have. So this one's in green. Green is my favorite color and I bought this in Japan. And the very last item is eye drops from Sustain. I do have dry eyes, so I carry a bottle of eye drops just in case I need to hydrate my eyes. I find this to be really good. You can use this even when you're wearing contacts, which is really helpful for me. So that's it. I hope that you find this interesting. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you everyone for watching and thank you for spending your precious time here. Have a great week ahead and see you in my next one. Goodbye.